All right, y'all, so it looks like BTK is getting denied scrims. So the teams in NA don't want to scrim against them because I guess they don't want to help them get better, which, I mean, th that's crazy if this is what's going on. So we finna check it out, man. Y'all know I'm already not a fan of how North America has to move when it comes down to Zane. It's one thing not to like a guy, but doing everything that you can to try to sabotage him is just weird. Like, for me, being a competitor... I would want to be so much better than the person that I destroy them at their best. I wouldn't want to make them weak and then beat them as if I'm some big man or something like that. No, you're, you're weak. You had to make somebody weak in order to take them on. Like, no, I want you at your most powerful so I can show you that I'm better than your best. But, hey, that's just me. Like, some people just don't got heart like that. But let's check, let's check it out and see what's going on, man. And, yeah, let me know what y'all think about it. Twice, but like over like a long time. Uh, TOB and and DA doesn't want to scrim us. Yours? Did you guys scrim versus GG? Yeah, like a month over a month, not like a month ago maybe. Them and DA don't want to scrim BTK. Them and DA don't want to scrim. They're just jerking each other off in scrims instead of scrimming us. Did you scream against GG at least once? Twice. Please pick a hero. Twice. But like over like a long time. Uh TOB and and DA doesn't want to scrim us. We gate keep scrims now too. <laughs> Welcome to North America. So our scrim partners are like I mean, really, you just say 77 and like the Bloodhounds and Fiends a little bit. Just saw those two teams. Fwide Rat move. Yeah, I heard Chicken is one of them that doesn't want to scrim. Yeah. That's crazy. And I, but I, I mean, I kind of can see why. I, I mean, I, I can assume why. I can assume that they want to actually win. So they don't want BTK actually getting better because what's crazy is. BTK isn't performing horrible, and they're, if they're not getting scrims, they're not getting all the advantages, they're not getting all the practice that all these other teams are getting. So if you're putting them at a disadvantage and they're still able to compete and they're among the top teams in the country still, obviously put a little practice behind that and they, they are probably going to be better than y'all. But the reason that that's stupid is because you should want BTK to become their best selves. You should want them to be their best version because the fact of the matter is once you get out of North America and you go up against the other teams, now you're going from the, the skill gap is going to be so high because you're used to watering down the skill of your own country and playing against inferior versions. You're not playing against the best your, country's, your country has to offer. So... You go to another country, you probably won't even, and to be fair, even if you took a, a, on Zane at his best, that's still not even close to, like, the Philippines. So, it's like you're practicing against, you're damn near just playing classic matches, to be fair, when it comes down to actually trying to compete in another country. But, hey, I guess, if that's the strategy you want to go with. It, it kind of is a quadrat move. Chicken's one of the people that's Said no scrim. I'm pretty sure. A little bit of a fight rat. When the body suffers, fight was one of the people I heard that didn't want to scrim. Which what are you gonna do about it? Welcome to North America. Why do you don't want to scrim, you guys? Cause they're noobs. Cause they're noobs. Ask Kush. The enemy is chicken. Uh, Kush got beat up by Chris's Hilda, and then they never wanted to scrim after that. <laughs> I'm not kidding either. I'm I'm not kidding. That's how it was. So they got destroyed and said never again. When the point of scrim, like that's the problem. It's too much ego in North America. Like a scrim is supposed to be win or lose. It doesn't matter because you're just supposed to be improving. You're supposed to be giving each other feedback, letting each other know like how to improve, how to get better, and you're all. 
both teams are supposed to be getting a lot better from scrimming. But when one team gets destroyed and then gets in their feelings and doesn't even want to continue scrimming and, and facing off against another team, then you're not improving. You're not getting better. So what was the whole, what's the whole point? Like, what are you doing? It's just weird that North American players can't see how they hold themselves back from being successful and great in this game. It's sad. But, I mean, that's why this country is horrible. So, yeah, let me know what you all think in the comment section down below, fam. Be sure to drop that thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on notifications, and I'll catch y'all on the next one. Peace out, fam.